Hi, we are going to talk about how to insert Foley catheter to male and female patients. But before we're going to start, a disclaimer, this video is solely for nursing educational purposes only. So, review your hospital policies or the modules that your clinical instructor gave you. To start, considerations in inserting Foley catheter, it should be a septic technique and with doctor's order. Hand washing, do not forget this. And verify your patient name and date of birth. It is also important to maintain privacy to your patients. Gather all the materials and check the Foley catheter set packaging. Please note for the expiration date and the validity of the set. So we have here the materials inside the packaging. We have the drape, the gloves, the fenestrated drape, betadine, cotton, tong, lubricating gel, saline, and the Foley catheter set. Once everything is set up, do hand washing. Okay, I already have the set here. I already removed it from the package. Always remember to touch the edge only of this packaging since we are maintaining for the sterility. So, keep in mind that sterility is important no matter what happens. On top of the packaging is the drape. This is the drape that we are going to use to cover the area of the patient or the vagina or the penile area of the patient. So this is what it looks like. That's the, that's the thing. Okay, so we're going to use that to cover the area. Just to expose the most important thing that we are going to insert. So if you can see, there is also gloves here, a sterile gloves that we are going to use during the insertion. Okay, do not forget to maintain sterility as always. Okay, we're ready to wear our sterile gloves. But this time, we are just going to check for the Foley catheter set. We are not yet going to insert for the Foley catheter because we need to check if the Foley catheter is having a problem or not so that we will, we will not be having a trouble in the near future please make sure guys that you are wearing the right size of your gloves set aside the drape for the meantime and we're going to check for the packaging or the materials that we have right here so I have here the tong which we're going to use to get for the cotton and this betadine up right here you can pour later on the betadine applicator here to the other cottons. We also have here the specimen bottle because later on we're going to see the urinalysis analysis of the patient, urine culture, and all. So this is the specimen bottle and it is sterile. This is the flush, a 10cc flush sterile water. And this is the lubricating gel. We're going to use this one during the insertion of the Foley catheter to the patient's vagina or penile area. And at the bottom of this one is the Foley catheter set. Please note for the size of the Foley catheter of your patients. On this area, we are going to put the 10cc syringe or sterile water here. And in this area, we're going to get the specimen. So if you can see, the one covered is sterile. However, in the other line, it's already clean. So this part, it's already clean until the end of the euro bag. We will use this area to drain the euro bag. Before the insertion of Foley catheter, we need to check if the balloon in the catheter is working. So we're going to insert or push 10 cc sterile water to check if it's patent or not or if the balloon is okay or not so here it is it's working so you can see the balloon is working so if it's like that it is fine it is okay and we can use it 
Of course, do not forget to remove that one. To remove, to remove the sterile water because we are going to use this poly catheter for the insertion. And we're set. This time, we are prepared. Now position your patient. Don sterile gloves. And we are already ready for the poly catheter insertion. Always remember to maintain sterility. Okay, so we're getting there. Okay, we are already prepared for the insertion. So, itong drape na to, ilalagay natin siya sa may puwetan ng pasyente kasi gagamitin natin yan later on sa ating mga materials. And this drape, ilalagay natin siya pang cover sa area lang na kailangan natin and which is the poo-poos. Okay, gotcha. So, exposed only the area that is needed. We are going to use the applicator Pwede tayong gumamit ng betadine na may cotton or the applicator or clean set na meron dito sa packaging natin. So this time, gagamit tayo ng swab. Ito yung swab. Usually, chlorhex swab yan or betadine swab. Depende kung ano yung nandoon sa laman, na laman ng set. Okay? So we are also going to use the techniques on how to clean the poops or the vagina of the, of the patient. So, using your non-dominant hand or yung kamay na hindi mo laging ginagamit, ibubuka ka mo yung uh, vagina ng babae. And yung dominant hand naman, yun yung gagamitin pang clean. Okay? Pang clean ng kanyang labia. So, ganyan. And after the cleaning, we are set to insert for the Foley catheter in the urinary meatus. So, since we checked everything already, prepared na tayo. So, put the lubricant gel and locate for the meatus and insert for the Foley catheter. Advance the catheter until my backflow. Remember, until my urine backflow doon sa catheter. At kapag meron ng backflow, that's the time that we are going to push for the 10cc sterile water in order to anchor it. Ayan. So, tapos na. Ganun lang. Okay. So, ayan na. We are done inserting the Foley catheter. But we need to make sure to anchor that Foley catheter on the legs of the patient. We need to put a tape in the legs of the patient. And hang the bag. Hang ha, not in the floor. It should be hanging. And you can connect it to the patient's bed. This is to prevent the ascending infection. Okay? So, dapat nakahang yan to prevent ascending infection. This time, we are also going to insert a Foley catheter to male patients. So, by this time, we need to clean for the glands penis until the base of the penis using circular motion. And this time, we are using cotton and betadine. Remember to do circular motion in cleaning the, gland, the penis of the patient. So, once done, we are going to lubricate for the Foley catheter and insert the Foley catheter using 90 degrees. Ayan, ganyan dapat. Using 90 degrees. And just insert the Foley catheter until a backflow of urine will be seen in the Euro bag. So, ayan, may backflow na siya. And then, we're ready to push for the 10cc sterile water. And we're set. Ganyan lang siya. And we're done. Now, it's time for us to anchor the tube. Clean the area and anchor the Foley catheter tube. Mm -hmm. 
These are the CDC guidelines for cauti prevention and appropriate use of Foley catheter. So I guess that's all for this video. See you again. Bye.